Hey folks, I'm Big Sun. Today we're going to take a look at something which is a bit weirder than usual. We're going to check out M Hero, a software by Program Studio, which is trying to improve your accuracy at shooting games. And it's not really my thing. I'm not playing so much shooters, and I'm not really competitive enough to care too much about aiming precision. But still, I was curious to see what kind of exercise we could be asked to do in this thing to just make us better at it. So first we might want to begin by checking the options, there is a few important things here and I think the most important thing is probably the, the game panel here which has only two options for now, we've got the Counter Strike Go and the Overwatch panel and it would be important to have more of these because obviously you might want to choose a setup which is going to be closer to the game you're actually playing if you want to get better at it and just two is not going to be enough so let's just uh, now advance a bit more. We've got the sensitivity, which is also important to be able to tweak because obviously you can tweak the sensitivity in different games. Then we've got the crosshair. We've got a few different crosshair, which are going to be handy to maybe uh, have the same kind of crosshair. And the hard mode would be probably the disable, so no crosshair. You will just uh, shoot uh, like that. And uh, let's just go back. There is nothing else which is interesting in the option. Let's just uh, start. We've got a few kind of training. We've got the classics, classics, traffic, penta, simple and reflex, and fast aiming. And each is going to offer you one map. I'm pretty sure it's the same one for now. And uh, oh, it's not the same one. There is a few more. And I believe it will be interesting to have even more. Still, we cannot move, so it's not going to be that important. It's more like a shooting range. And we've got different kind of skill. I'm going to go with... Is there a default? I'm going to go with low because I'm not that good. And um, we'll just try the first one. Okay, let's, let's just go with medium. And here it is. We can, we can only move the cursor here. I need to press R to begin. And they are going to give me a few targets which are going to appear. And then each time I'm going to miss one, I'm going to lose a life. So I need to shoot as much as possible in a defined period of time and it's going to start very very soon and let's just go so the, the targets are going to get increasingly bigger and now and then they are going to just uh, shrink until they disappear and when they disappear you, you lose life still it's maybe not that interesting to watch but you can see how it's giving you an advantage if you just train enough Oh, and you can see also the, the missed shot on the panel. Oh, come on, don't do that. I'm going to miss a few very, very soon. Oh, I'm beginning to lose the rhythm. I need to accelerate a bit. And let's just keep going. So this one is obviously the, the most simple training. Oh, oh, come on, I'm going to get done here. Let's just not go too crazy. We've got a few more I need to be focused and calm if I want to manage to get the most of them and done so I got a few and we're not going to do it again I'm going to show you the different kind of trainings it's not that interesting to watch it's really mainly for training so let's go back we've got also the, tra the strafing here and do we have another stage now so let's just go with that and so this one is going to be a bit different because uh, I think the target are going to move so it's going to be more about timing uh, let's just take a look at this so you see you might want to shoot it while okay so each time you're going to shoot it you're going to make a point and i'm just okay i'm just going to wait for the thing come on buddy i think i'm not patient enough for this i tend to to burst into <laughs> just surprise my enemy not to be very very precise in uh, most of this game the thing is to be bold if you want to surprise these people which has f for now be the, been the most efficient strategy I've, I've got okay come on stop doing that all right not going to hold that much time plus uh, when i've been trying all of this training at the end i was just my wrist was hurting so this can be quite extensive, and I believe you cannot do this for very long. Come on, I'm losing, I'm missing so much shot. I think my pre precision is going to be very, very low. Come on, stop doing that. Plus, it's ah. 
Okay, so I think this is that. The thing is going to try to go away from your cursor and you can move him this from direction to direction. Let's just go and show you something else. We've got the Panta here. So this one's going to be on a different site. I'm going to go for this one just to see what it looked like. And let's just start. So Okay, so here we are. Once again we cannot move. We are, it's just about aiming. There is no uh, move involved, which is a bit of a shame because it would be, I think it would be more realistic to be able to strafe and stuff. Maybe if they could just shoot at you, it would just improve the, the pressure. Where am I going? And where are these targets? Oh, over there, okay. So I need to find them. But... Oh, that way. Okay. So only here? Quite a bunch. Uh, it's still about timing. I need to get them all. Okay, let's see. Halfway. Okay, so this one is uh, the Pantama. So it's going to give you a bunch of targets which are going to move pretty fast, and you need to get them all. Then there is a simple mod, and we have a new. Let's go with uh, B side. And okay, so it's going to be a bit more confused. So where are going to be this target? I think these are going to pop up up these walls, kind of. Oh, over there. Okay. I want to come back. There we go. So each time you're going to shoot one, it's going to reappear again. And this this is probably useful for when people are hiding behind stuff, so you can just shoot them when they pop out, even if they are far. Alright, where is the light? next one? It's the easiest way is just to set the right pot and wait for them to show up. Oh, wrong. So wrong. Come on. Another one here. Let's just get it. And another one here. So, I'm just not going to finish it, let's just show you another one. So it's simple, there is also reflex. And we've got only one level on this one. And we're just going to, to go for a very, very difficult one just to see what kind of L we can unleash. And so this one is going to be much, much harder. Okay, so. Okay, not going to do it. I'm just too slow for this. Oh, uh, come on. Nah, oh, one. Well, incredible, I didn't expect to, act to even touch one. Two. I'm too freaking slow. I need to wait for it to pop close to me if I want to be able to... Ah, come on. I'm very, very bad. I think, in a way, I would need this thing if I was playing more uh, shooter, but... Okay, let's get out of here. Too difficult. Let's go for the next one. I think reflex is probably good, but mm, I is just too fast. Let's just see the difference between I and low, just to see how... Oh, uh, fast it has, it has become. We are just m much closer to the panel here, and now we need to. Okay, it's still very fast, but we are much closer, so it's easier to just navigate through. Even though I'm not, I'm not managing to get any of these. Come on. Oh, okay. So it's really a reflex mod. It's not bad. And I believe if you just do it often, you can really improve your skill. Still. Okay, let's just show you the last mod, so the fast aiming mod. Uh, still only one level, and we're just going to stick to medium because I is definitely too difficult for me. And let's just start. So this one is going to... It's a bit like the first mod, except this is target are not going to grow bigger. And you need to go very fast, and I believe you might want to maybe follow the way they are popping. Okay, so I had very little time. And okay, still walking. So guys, I think we are not going to go much further with this video. We've been seeing most of the mods, and it's a pretty simple uh, software to understand. So guys, thank you for watching. I like the video. If you do, please leave a like, a comment, or subscribe. And until next time, guys, happen.